Returning to Florida State had always been a goal for Mike Bell. So when head coach Mike Martin asked Bell to be his pitching coach in 2012, he didn't hesitate to accept the offer to return to Dickhauser Stadium. Coming back to Florida State was probably a dream come true, the way Florida State teaches the game of baseball. Uh, there's no doubt in the back of the mind, it was a dream, it was an aspiration. FSU has been a huge part of Mike Bell's life. He was a standout player under head coach Mike Martin in 1994 and 95, where he was teammates with other assistant coach Mike Martin Jr. He reached the College World Series both seasons with the Seminoles. Bell and his wife Alicia even formed their own team here. It's a special place for, for my wife Alicia and, and I, we met here, uh, so it was, it was kind of a homecoming in a sense. Bell has been the pitching coach at Florida State for six years now, but before returning to his alma mater, he was an assistant coach at Florida Southern, Tennessee, and Oklahoma, as well as a player in the Montreal Expos organization. His experiences have led him to become one of the most highly regarded coaches in the NCAA, transforming the Knolls' young pitching staff into one of the best in the country. Coach Bell is a guy who really understands the game probably more than anyone I've ever met. Coach Bell is he's a type of coach that he makes you get better every day. And I mean, if you do something wrong, he tells you and he helps you get better. And if you do something right, he pats you on the back too, but he's not going to sit there and tell you that you're the best pitcher ever. Even though it's been more than 20 years since he played at the college level, Coach Bell still remembers what it was like to take the mound at Dick Hauser. I think as a player, you're going out to win each and every day. As a coach, you're trying to prepare the young man to put them in the best situation possible for them to find success, but also for us to find victory. For Florida State baseball fans, the bullpen may appear to be where most of the work gets done for the Seminole pitchers. But for Coach Bell, this is only a small part of the process. Coach Bell believes in fostering a relationship with his pitchers beyond the mound and molding them into better people, not just better players. He's just always constantly helping me out on and off the field, no matter what it is. Just in everyday life even, he just, he's there to talk to you and get you better, be the best player and person that you want to be. You, you learn how to handle different personalities. Um, I never knew that going into coaching baseball would be a part-time psychologist. But learning how to manage people, learning how to get the most out of them, and more importantly, uh, striving to put them in the best position to be successful, not only for baseball, but for life after baseball. And that's what we strive to do here. That passion to improve his players extends to the rest of the team, as Bell is also the associate head coach for the Seminoles and considers his role on the staff to be the most rewarding of his career. Uh, Florida State fans in general, uh, year to year the players change, uh, you know, from roster to roster, from graduation to signing professional contracts. But the one thing that's always been constant are the people that run it, and it, it is such a family atmosphere. Uh, it's like having 35 sons in a locker room. When his sixth regular season with Florida State comes to an end, Bell and the rest of the Seminoles hope to end up in Omaha for another appearance in the College World Series. Because when it comes down to it, we're all together. We're all in this fight together. We're all striving for the, for the same thing. I'm Jacob Russo for Seminole Sports Magazine.